come and meet some of my garden friends. They've all got their own unique personalities. This buff banded rail's name is Growly because of her kind of a growly voice. She really likes the water pot. The calling in the background is from a noisy fryer bird. They're feeding on the fruits of the bangalow palm. That's little P. P for pigeon, P for person. There he is with his wife, Mrs. P. No wildlife garden would be complete without insects. This is Rama, and for a wild bird, they're a very friendly person. And right at home, on the veranda railing too. Flowering bottle brush. Flowering prickly paper bark. This is Rover and her chicks. She follows me around the garden. That's why she's got that name. Our fences have gaps underneath them to allow the wildlife to easily come and go. This green tree frog likes to live in our drain pipe. They like to perch on our pots and on our sugar cane. That's a little faithful because she always pops by in the evening. This one's looking for ants that are on the sugar cane. They have soft rubbery beaks which they use to help locate their food. We always know when an echidna is in the garden because we can hear that shuffling kind of sound they make when they walk along the ground. That's Dad. He's popped by for some banana. I like the sound of Dad eating banana. And that's Snakey, our resident coastal carpet python. This was filmed just outside our bedroom door. I hope you enjoyed meeting some of our garden friends and I encourage you to make your own garden whatever your situation because you can always share it with an animal and make a garden friend. 
Remember to subscribe and if you liked this video, give it the thumbs up.